we are 30 years old this year and when we were looking at uh, our fundamental purpose was to bring medical science you know the best in the world to india for indians and from here for the rest of the world and and without this piece of research and innovation we will be left behind and we looked at it very uh, you know thoroughly and and we have the best researchers advising us and Seamanth here was given the task two years ago when he joined us and he and we said we must have research as a very important pillar and one of the things they did that you know these three bright scientists were looking they worked all you know all over the world especially in the US and they wanted to come back to India but they didn't find they found great potential but they said that they, it was difficult to come back so we said let us help you let us be you know an incubator and, and then they said, yes, we'll come back to India. And I must thank Dr. Hari Prasad for his wonderful health city that actually convinced them to come to Hyderabad, where we are. Otherwise, they, they were thinking of Chennai, they were thinking of Delhi. And then, but uh, when they looked at this health city that we have here, so they said, we would really like to be located here. And in this process for us, we were very long, we said it's important uh, because we have over 50 hospitals in the country and many of them that have the best in technology in terms of cancer care and all these. So we have the samples available with us, probably the largest amount in the country if you take it collectively. So we said, what can we do? And, and this tissue bank, which he said is set up on the best of the ethics that you can have worldwide. So there's no controversy about it at all. And what, what this will actually do in layman's term, what, what convinced us is, it will bring down the cost of drug discovery and it will speed it up in terms of medicines on these disease tissues they can actually find out. You know, in the West and all, it's getting very hard to find stage 3 cancers and all these samples. Here we can do it and I think that the quality and the quantity of samples we can get out, this will become cutting edge. That's number one in terms of the tissue bank. From our personal side, I think that Apollo has done the largest number of checkups preventive checkups in the world and, and especially in India as a group and we've really evangelized it. Over the years we've come out with new standards based on the number of checkups we've done. We've said what is it for Asians? This personalized medicine just takes it to another level. You know all of you have heard about Angelina Jolie and what she did and how that DNA testing and what this thing. But, but you know for the common man it's there for everyone. You don't have to do such extreme steps, but if we can give you the prediction of a, of a heart disease or anything, you know, years in advance, or the probability of getting cancer, I think it takes this personalized medicine and our preventive medicine to a whole new level. So I think that's why we're very excited, and, and especially the fact that we can get three brilliant scientists to come back and do their thing here and be a part of us. Uh, it's a great thing for us. It's all about sapien today i love your logo